In the first part of our series presenting dogs from different nations of the world, we introduced you to the most important dog breeds originating from Russia. In the second part, let's venture even further east and deal with Japanese dog breeds. If you're curious about the rest of the series, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and press the bell button so you'll always be notified of new parts. In Japan, unlike some other Asian countries, dogs have always been surrounded by esteem and respect, perhaps in part because of the prevalence of the Buddhist religion. There is no better proof of this than the animal protection orders and laws that have survived from the Japanese Middle Ages, which could embarrass the practices of many countries today. The fifth shogun of the Tokugawa era, Tokugawa Tsunayoshi, for example, had already enacted laws to protect dogs as early as the late 17th century, because of that his contemporaries, with some irony, with noble simplicity, named him Inu Shogun or Dog Shogun. In this list, we have selected the 11 breeds that are most widely known, but it is not certain that dog lovers are aware of their Japanese origin. 11. Ryukyu Inu This particularly rare dog breed from the island of Okinawa is not recognized as a standalone breed by the Japanese Kennel Club these days, but it is considered by most Japanese people. What we know from the descriptions about them is that they were once bred specifically for wild boar hunting. Their standalone unique feature is the extra claw on the back of the paw, which is said to serving that these dogs are able to climb trees. 10. Japanese Terrier The development of this small-sized terrier breed probably took place in 17th century Japan, when smooth-haired fox terriers, or their predecessors, coming to Japan with western traders mixed with local small-sized breeds. This mini-dog, who are also known as the Nippon Terriers, function primarily as companion dogs besides their owners, but are also said to be suitable for hunting, it seems that the terrier's blood has not become water. 9. Kaiken or Kai Dog Kaiken is a native Japanese breed that comes from the higher mountainous areas of the Japanese islands. They are also sometimes referred to as Tora or Tora Inu, from which the word Tora means tiger in Japanese, which refers on the one hand to the fearless character of Kaikens, and on the other hand to their mostly tiger-striped colors and outlook. They were kept primarily as hunting dogs and as the guardians of homes. 8. Hokkaido This medium-sized dog is, according to the Japanese, the superman of spitz-type dogs, which stands out from other dogs of this type. They can live in almost any weather conditions, they tolerate extreme cold climates, they are excellent hunters and their sense of smell is said to be as developed as that of the English bloodhounds. There are many Japanese stories about Hokkaidos who found their way and get home from hundreds of miles with the heck of their noses. 7. Kishu Ken or Kishu Dog They also show spitz marks, they are dogs who are very similar to Akitas and Shiba Inus, and how surprising they developed in the Kishu region of Japan. They have also been used for hunting for centuries. Black, yellowish, and red color variations are also known, but really appreciated by the Japanese are the white individuals who are extremely expensive to buy all over the world. 6. Shikoku This special breed, which is the only Japanese dog that looks like wolves on the outside, also belongs to the Spitz family. The people living on the island of Shikoku bred them for wild boar hunting, and since they were free to roam the forests outside the hunting seasons and even had to take care of their own meals by hunting, they have become a very freedom-loving and independent breed, who cannot be trained and educated by the Western type of training methods. 5. Japanese Spitz The Japanese Spitz is a descendant of the German Spitz that came to Japan in the 1920s, who today have found their place primarily as companion and family dogs in Japan and other parts of the world. Their special feature is their snow-white color, which makes them especially popular in Japan. Due to their small size, Ray are becoming increasingly popular in Europe and other parts of the world. 4. Japanese Akita Inu Well, if anyone has heard the name of Hachiko, who has become a role model for dog loyalty around the world, you know which breed we are talking about. The Akita is the largest of the Japanese Spitz type of dogs, and has been used in dogfights in addition to hunting for many centuries. During World War II, they became almost extinct due to the military industry's need for dog hair collars, and thanks only a few dedicated breeders that the breed have been saved. 3. Japanese Chin It has a depressed face, bulging eyes, fluffy hair, and a long history. 
Although there has been tremendous controversies over their origins in sinological circles, they have been one of the vibrant and active accessories of the Japanese imperial court for centuries. Their unique feature is that they are considered to be one of the most cat-like dog breeds, as they clean themselves like cats, like to sit on high places, and like to hide in closed boxes and corners. In this sense, they can be an ideal choice for an owner who can't decide between dogs and cats. 2. Shiba Inu Small in stature and huge in personality, the Shiba Inu is perhaps one of the best-known Japanese dog breeds. This dog, which looks very similar to the fox, is the oldest of the six Japanese Spitz-type breeds and, although they almost became extinct during World War II, has now become popular all over the world. An extremely intelligent, yet insanely stubborn dog breed, keeping them can quite give up the lesson for a novice dog owner. 1. Tosa Inu Of course, subjective, but for us the most impressive and respectable Japanese dog breed is the Tosa Inu. This dog breed is the only one in the world that has been bred for the sole purpose of fighting other dogs, which has had a huge tradition in Japan since the samurai era. They are the descendants of ancient Japanese breeds, such as Akitas, and the large-bodied Mastiffs imported by Westerners to Japan. In addition to their awesome fighting abilities and qualities, as the Tosas have few, if any successful opponents in the dog world, they are a distinctly family-friendly breed who will stand their ground perfectly as guardians, as well. What is your favorite Japanese breed? Feel free to write it to us in a comment. Anyway, if you like this series, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell button as well to get instant notifications about the new parts. Thank you very much for your attention.